a biased training to police review, Racine Mayor Corey Mason announcing his plan to bring both immediate and long-term reform to the city's police department. Fox 6's Sam Kramer dives into the details with reaction from Racine residents tonight. Near the corner of 18th and Mead, Anita Morris watches her grandchildren with mixed emotions. There's delight with kids just enjoying the summer. But she also describes fear when talking about possible interactions with police. Back in the day, you can tell your kids you get in trouble. You go to the police. They'll help you out. You take them to the police now. There's no telling what's going to happen because you can't trust them. That principle is at the core of Mayor Corey Mason's plan to reform the Racine Police Department, both immediately and long term, to place an even bigger emphasis on community policing a step the city first took in 1996. We've done some good work there, but there's more work for us to do, and that's what this task force is about and this community engagement is about. Mason will require all officers to take implicit bias training, order the review of the department's use of force policies by a community task force, and wants to hire more officers of color to better match the city's demographics. If that training creates an opportunity to expand people's perspectives on interacting with community members and gives the community more confidence that uh, the police force has been trained on those issues, I think that's helpful for everyone. And for community members like Morris, there is hope, but also skepticism that things will actually change. In the end, she's seeking the best future for her grandkids. I want them to be safe wherever they are. In Racine, Sam Kramer, Fox 6 News. Now, we reached out to the Racine Police Department for comment. A spokesman declined to address the plan, but says the department is always open to improving police practices, not just during times of crisis. You can read the mayor's entire police reform plan on fox6now.com.